Call me culture vulture, garbage, those are ignorant words. I kill a vulture, cook the poultry in a pan till it's burnt. See, Marshall, I'm just like you. I'm flipping the bird. Dear Slim. <laughs> What's good, y'all? It's the Duma Shats React, and we're back with another video. Listen, I know you guys are wondering where Sierra is. Today, she's not feeling too well, but she will be back. Make sure you guys send positive energy this way so she can come back to the channel. We need her. We need her. Listen, but we're back with another Tom McDonald video called Dear Slim. Listen, I'm going to be honest with y'all. I don't know if I clicked fast because I thought it was a, 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 a Slim Shady Eminem diss track, or was it because it was Tom McDonald? Because listening to Tom McDonald back in, you know, our time whenever we was jamming him, everything he was saying was just factual, was true, and it would hit home around all the boards. But now and now he got a Dear Slim. It could either be him writing a letter to Slim or it could be a diss track to Slim. And I'm just, I, I need to know what's going on. So I'm here for it. You guys send this into us. We're about to check it out right now. Dear Slim, Tom McDonald. Oh, we're on the road to 50K. Listen, make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe, smash the notification bell so the video can go ding a ding ding every time we upload a new video. Without further ado, let's get into the vid. Dear Slim, I thought you might have heard of me, maybe. Cause lately everywhere I turn, someone's comparing us crazy. I never mm. would have thought when I was bumping Binky and Pac that I would buy bleach in a box and become the product of the shade. Who would have thought when I was jamming big in your pocket, I would buy bleach in the box and become a product of shady? <sighs> Yo, you gotta be in this man's shoes to really feel like exactly what he just said right there. I understand where he coming from, but you gotta be in his shoes to understand. I'm jamming big in your pocket, but I'm still a. Uh, I, <clears throat> that by itself, T Tom, how you jump in the track so fast? So soon, and you come off like this. Like, this is. Ha! <laughs> this is it, bro. This is it. Now. Hi, my name is Tom McDonald. People call me controversial. I'm the one that counterculture follows. Right. Every song I drop's a problem. I offend an awful lot with topics commenting on race and politics. I'm pretty awesome. Dear Slim, mm. I know we're very different politically. Seems like some of your biggest fans are the victims of triggering. Woo! Kids I don't like you, which ain't consistent with history. I was picked on as a kid, and they don't know what Slim did for me. But mm. I'm here now. And I fight the system just like you. Was addicted to. <laughs> and I fight a system just like you. Tom just said something that was powerful right there. Right there, he just said something that was really powerful. My man said that he was going through something at his age and his time when he when, when he was at you know living his life and he would listen to Slim and Slim helped him get out of situations, right? And I feel like we can all relate to this. Even when Sierra was sitting right here with me, we had a comment where we was like. Slim made uh, this track. Uh, I say, I'm sorry, mom. I never meant to hurt you. Never meant, but I'm clean. I'm a class. Yeah, we all jammed that track. That track helped us. We all have Eminem tracks that we jammed. And Tom just said that it, he jammed Eminem coming up. Right? And Eminem helped him out of a lot of situations. Why? Because the music is pure. And he do get compared to Eminem a lot. Let's go, y'all. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Pills and liquor and quit them just like you. People claim that you hate me, but Marshall, that can't be right, dude. Right. You'd have to hate yourself as well as Marshall. I'm you. Marshall, remember back when you became Eminem. Mm. You changed the world with a pen. Well, now I'm just like you. I don't give a white sand what I want with my biggest up. Everybody triggered and they think I suck. But I don't give a white name. Hold up, 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 hold up. Hold up, hold up, hold up. What does the car stand for? Because the car looked like it came from out of a swamp. <laughs> the car looked like it just came from out of the water, literally. Rain is still falling on the worst on the windshields, or the, the water that was inside of the car. And you can see that it's surrounded by a puddle, and it looked like it even has moss grass on it from underneath the water. Somebody help me, please. Help me, let me know. But that means something. He wouldn't just put a car in there for no reason like that. Dear 
you're slim. I thought that maybe because you paved the way for me, you might relate to weight that Caucasian rappers are carrying. They're constantly comparing us to you. It's embarrassing. Never gaining their approval. It's just hate we're inheriting. But I'm here now. Go ahead and hate it. Don't hurt. Call me culture vulture garbage. Those are ignorant words. I kill a vulture cooked to poultry in a pan till it's burnt. See, Marshall, I'm just like you. I'm flipping the bird. Dear Slim, I just want to give you your flowers. I Hey, listen, look, 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 wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute now, y'all, hold on now, hold on, I know what y'all thinking now, wait, flipping the bird and all that other stuff can look like it's something where, you know, it, it comes off as negative, but we all have a side of ourselves that we don't embrace as much, and sometimes, sometimes, it's okay to release some energy that you may have, right? So coming up as a kid, I can understand that you may be looking at your, one of your biggest artists is that you just really enjoy watching, right? And they may do something in private just so they can release steam. And you may feel that it may work for you as well. I feel where he coming from with that. <laughs> hey, Ross, I'm just like, yo, flicking the bird. That's funny. Wow. And hours memorizing all of your songs in 2000. You were the reason I screamed it out of my teachers. A teen, I needed your CD on repeat and Shady's face on my t shirt. Mm. But I'm here now. Call me controversial just like you. We're both white, both rat, both of our eyes blue. Ooh. Screw any guy who tries to say you've changed and don't like you. Because in my mind, it's still 99. And I'm you. Marshall and Amber back when you became an mm. You changed the world with a pen. Nice. Well, Come on. Nah, 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 nah. <laughs> that alone right there says so much about his personality. Because all this artists these days never realize that whenever you on the track and you and you let people listen to it, they don't want to hear monotone. They want to hear you, and I love that he could be free in his music. Nah, 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 like that is just genius right there to me, right? Because you're being yourself, and that's what it means when you step into the mic. You can't step to the mic and be nobody else. No matter, just like he said, no matter how much they compare us, right? At the end of the day, I'm Tom, you're M, and, and, and yeah, we just both make fire music. That's the facts. Come on, man. Come on, man. Whether you love me or hate me or think I'm crazy Got a hundred grand to get a beat from Shady huh. He hoped when I bought it he wasn't angry But I really had to tell him that he changed me The truth of the matter is without you martial matters I would have committed suicide before I was a rapper He showed me that I could do it I didn't need to be black or I know it's stupid But I just had to do my best to say thank you we ain't gonna speed past that. Hold on now. We ain't gonna speed past what he just said. Let me play it back just ahead. Me, no, I don't gotta play it back for y'all heard it. And I'm gonna play it back just ahead for y'all. Hold on, man. Hold on, 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 hold on. Told me that I could do it. I didn't need to be black or I know it's stupid, but I just had to do my best to say thank If I heard correctly, he said that I didn't need to be black to do it. I didn't need to be black to make it into the industry. Now, hold on now. Listen now. I, I, I know a lot of people probably like, yeah, cause this world is really, <clears throat> this, this world, it, it, it comes to a point where at some point, a lot of people, a lot of people, and I'm not talking about everybody when I say a lot, because we got a majority of, a, a mass majority of people in this world, but a, a, a group likes to stand on racism and use that as a card when a white male may say something about a black male or just a black in general, right? But what I'm hearing right here when he's saying that I didn't need to be black, to make it, you know, this industry is hip hop. Hip hop is black cultural music, and imagine how how how, how difficult it may be to you know be a white male climbing your way to the top without having to go through all these avenues. And, and uh, think about it, Tom doing this all by himself. Y'all can go down all his fees, and he'll show you that I've been doing this by myself for the longest. So whenever he says that, I feel it because some people may run through the quick door to success just to get a quick film, just to get a quick view, just to get a quick dollar, just to make it like that. While others may take the staircase, others may take the, the alley by themselves, dark roads by themselves and make it. But at the end of the day, it's like we, we this is hip hop. And he didn't have to be, you know, Labeled as his as his race or his color to make it in this industry, 
He just been himself and he was very transparent with everything that he put on the platform. And I feel like that's what really generated him to his audience. You know what I mean? You got to find your... Oh, I wish Sierra was here right now. She can put words in my mouth. Uh, but this is it, yo. I really felt that line. It wasn't about quick, but I felt that one. I felt that one. Yo, I, Sierra and I has, have grown to like really enjoy Tom's music, yo. Because for one, being controversial is something that we like to dip and dabble in. Because it's not it's not the it's not the argument in between. It's the mindset of what people may think towards situ situations, yo. And I find that so interesting. Yo, a, a fire track, right? Listen, man, we're on the road to 50K, man. Make sure you guys like the button. Make sure you guys subscribe to the Dumas Chefs React, man. And we're going to catch you guys on the next video. Peace.